All right, so today is a pretty sad day. The Urus is getting shipped out to Arizona. So yeah, I sold the Urus. How did that happen? I'll explain. So the 450 got tinted the other day. 20% on the windshield. <laughs> five over 20 on the sides and then well five over 20 on the front too and then the factory is 20 so we did five over that to match the front and this is normally what i do on the front windows but for whatever reason i mean normally you can't see in the windows no matter what obviously but from the inside this is 10 times darker than it normally is and this thing being a massive dually you kind of need to see these back wheels these back hips when you're going around back roads you know with uh with a big ass truck you don't want to come around a turn and have somebody just clip your back end which has happened to me before you don't need that happening oh so we're gonna do uh five percent we're gonna take off the 20 percent that's over the five on the fronts and we're also going to do the sunroof but this thing's actually gonna get torn apart entirely uh probably next week the blue truck that we finished a couple weeks ago has been Stereo system still sucks in these 2022s. Good news is I got a um, upgraded system for the doors and the tweeters because the systems suck. So Mobile Toys, uh, who does all of my sub boxes for all of my personal trucks, is doing yet again another sub box for this thing like he did for my last 450, my 2020. And it's gonna be badass, it's gonna be very loud. But first, for the first time, I'm also doing door speakers in a Ford. I've never done the door speakers in the Ford. I've always just dealt with it being super, super bad. And I'm pretty excited to have a good sound system just all around because before on the 2020 at least, it just, the subs drowned out the door speakers. It was God awful. So super excited for that. Um, but yeah, the Urus is leaving today. So we're gonna drive to the back. We're gonna get this thing all ready and then we're gonna drive over to meet the, uh, this thing does rub a little bit. We're gonna drive over to meet the transporter that's picking it up down at the middle school down the road. Dude, I can't get over the interiors on these things. I'm so glad that they did navy. You know what? It matches the Ferrari perfect, but sadly, the Ferrari is going to be leaving us soon as well. Ooh, it is windy. I'm sorry about that, guys. So no lug covers yet. We have the chrome caps. Those are going on. I mean, don't ignore the way that this thing looks honestly as a whole right now. Just completely ignore it, please. It looks decent. These wheels are absolutely massive, 28s and uh, 37s. So it is only a two inch level, which is crazy because this thing is super, super tall. However, the plan is to do bags front and rear. We're gonna do a four link rear from PMF suspension when they're done with that. So four link in the front, well actually three link because we got the three link arms on there already. And then four link in the rear, bags front and rear. And we're gonna have ride height pretty much fender is going to be like down here so another two inches lower it's pretty much going to be stock height in the front at ride height and then in the back it'll be two inches lower than what it's at right now i just think that honestly on 28s and rubber bands it should definitely be lower closer to the wheel wells so yeah we're going to lower this thing we're going to white it out we already have a few parts i have the speakers i don't have the sub box yet but hopefully that's in by the time that this thing is apart realistically it's going to take us probably three weeks two to three weeks to paint everything which means that in that time, if the sub box comes in within that time frame before the paint and stuff comes back, then we can throw it in and we can have somewhat of a decent truck before the four link and the bag setup goes in. So there's a couple stages to the build process of this truck specifically. Usually that's how it goes with my personal trucks. Giveaway trucks get done all at once. But with my personal trucks, there's a little bit more involved, way more parts, a like a lot of departments, if you wanna put it that way. So we have the sub box going in, possibly when it gets painted. Paint is the main thing that we're pulling it apart for. Uh, we're gonna throw the stock springs back in the front, so these are gonna come out. Stock springs, bring it back down to stock height, and take the block out of the rear because it's a two inch block from factory. Take that out, lower that ass end to match the front. And it does rub now, it doesn't rub a lot, but the reason for me taking out the spring and running that is because first of all, the four link for the rear is not gonna be done for a little bit yet. So while this truck's completely color matched and it looks great, I kind of want it to kind of look like it will ride when it has the bag set up. So we're gonna drop it down. We will have to cut a lot, I know that for a fact, but it's gonna look absolutely sick, all whited out and dropped another two inches. So all the color match is gonna get done, all the lights are gonna get done, 
sub box is gonna get done door speakers are gonna get done it's gonna get lower two inches and we'll do the lug caps of course at that point the only reason we haven't yet is because we need to pull them off and those things are a pain in the ass to get off it's just something that i don't really feel like doing this thing's only going to be like this for another probably five days and out of those five days i'm probably going to drive it twice so it doesn't really matter too much to have lug caps and be busting right now anyways let's go get our baby out of here there she is so the ferrari got picked up today usually the ferrari is right here yours poor baby has been sitting down there forever literally don't drive this thing anymore that's why i sold it um 450 parking spot is now opened up so yeah ferrari is also for sale urus and ferrari both went up for sale at the same time this thing is going out to arizona and the ferrari is still available but the reason that i'm selling the ferrari is because i'm getting a porsche so i have a gt3 coming in and i feel like the gt3 is gonna fit this area much much better and it's gonna fit my needs much better honestly because i drive the hell out of my cars so gt3 i can put miles on ferrari i feel bad putting miles on it's just such a gorgeous car and i love it the interior is sick it's the navy blue just like the interior on the ford it'd be cool to have two trucks a truck and a car with the same exact color interior but either way the gt3 is nasty and i'm gonna enjoy that thing way more i think so urus yeah poor thing i just didn't drive it that's the thing i have an suv i bought an suv specifically to use that as my car to drive people around go far places and day-to-day -day driving and i just don't drive it i don't use it for that i use the m8 which is also a four-door so i'm getting rid of this i have the m8 which basically replaced this when i got the m8 i just drove that only i have 5,000 miles on this thing i've owned it for a year now just over a year so that's not much i mean it's still a lot for some people but Either way, I wanna daily drive it. It doesn't get driven. It's loud, it's flashy, the wheels are huge. One got bent once. I feel like I just don't have good luck with this car. Either way, don't drive it. Wanna get rid of it, getting rid of it. I'm gonna order a Range Rover soon to replace that once the 2023 Sports come out. And it's gonna be a lot more fun than the Yaris because again, same thing with the Range Rover. It's awesome, great interior, great car, it's fast. And I'm gonna drive it and actually use it versus this, I don't. So. Let's get that thing out of here. It's already all cleaned up. Just need to grab the key. <sighs> this thing's so pretty though. I just can't do the red interior. I like custom color interiors. The red's just too basic. Everybody has red. You know what sucks is that because of the hit, remember the mailbox thing? Um, I got way less than this thing's actually worth. So, kind of sucks, but you know, life happens. And uh, on to the next car. It's so loud. Here we go. windows are super dark too. Wow. So loud, dude. So loud. You want to take the camera and just film from the back? Yeah. Final Urus ride. Oh wow. It's pretty blown out. Come on. Let's catch us from here. speed he just hit there. in one piece the guest piece yes they're too hard yes sir <laughs>
<laughs> this is beeping. The final honk. It's like, baby, don't let me go. It's not enclosed. Yelling. It's not? It's not enclosed. Interesting. Um, I noticed that when we pulled up. I'm gonna text the guy and just be like, hey, this is, you're gonna put a wide body here. Just, just out in the out open. <laughs> on the tail end. I thought he wanted it enclosed. I guess not, huh? Yeah, so, but I don't know. So, dispatcher should say you that it's. What is it? The, the dispatcher is gonna say you that it's not enclosed. Oh, it doesn't matter? So, I'm gonna take it to the. I'm just a local driver. Oh, so you I'm take it somewhere take it else? To Pennsylvania, yeah. And so then they put it in enclosed. Big truck, they're gonna take it. Big trucks, okay. Look at this, in the lifted mode. Wait, no, I don't even think that's. Is it? Yeah, it is. It's got four different settings. Let's see, Corsa. You know what I'm not gonna miss about this thing? Those damn cup holders, dude. Those things are like Red Bull size and nothing more. You have a freaking Dunkin' Donuts cup or a Starbucks cup and you put one in here and then you try and put another one in here. Guess what, they're not fitting because the tops are gonna touch each other. It's absolutely ridiculous. It's I have the amount of like, ugh. It pisses me off and that's that's it that's it that's all you got you know what what's in here huh about a whole two inches two inches of room speaking of what you're gonna take all my goodies yours go yep yeah. the so thing. they're taking it to an enclosed trailer with this oh wow yeah and where's that pennsylvania oh wow four hours this thing's so clean last time i got washed was a month ago that's how often i drive this thing one drive and these things start getting caked up with like road debris so Sad to see it go, man. But it's just not usable. I can't even drive around. I can't even get my Dunkin' coffee in the morning because it doesn't fit, okay? It's just useless. Oh my God, my plate. Ah! My plate! Thank you. It's no longer property of the boss. TH3B0SS, <laughs> to be exact. Wow, that place is cool, huh? Oh, whoa. I kind of want to go in there. Looks pretty haunted, not gonna lie. So, can you just type your name inside the Oh, So, does this car going, like, lift it up? Yeah. He just lifted it up, right it up for ah, you. It's yep, it's all the way up right now. Set. All set? You don't mind if I just watch it? Hold on, Gio. Gio got to replace. Let me, let me check because I'm not sure it's high enough. It's this is the equipment. Dirty equipment here. Industrial. Yeah, it is. There we go. There we go. Yeah, keep going. Here it is. Get up. It's going. No, that's gonna go. Get a better shot. No, it's going. Get a better shot. Right here. Okay. It's going, it's close. Here it's close. You still have like three inches. Yeah, you have like three inches. That's what I'm saying. Once, okay. once it hops up, it keeps going up. Yep. I think we're perfect. You're good. I don't know if you want to just run over this. And you might hit, I don't know. Yeah, it's white. Yeah, you got the inside of the wheels too. You don't want to rub up on these. Nope. The back wheels are freaking wider too. I gotta babysit, make sure this is done right. I want to go to the, the left more. Oh, windshield wipers. Yup. Yeah. Oh, Jesus Christ. 
Jesus Christ. Ah, uh, you gotta go left. Left, left, left. Yeah. Left. Come on. Come. Jesus Christ. Hold on. I would just come a little bit more this way, but you're on it. You see it going over and that corner. Left. Yeah. Come on. You gotta go slow. Slow. All right, straighten out. Oh my God. You're good. Oh my God. It's so <laughs> You gotta watch out on that side. You're going to the right. No, you gotta, you gotta go to the left. Left, 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 left. All right, slow. Come on. He's gonna launch this thing into the f Volvo, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. Jesus Christ. Alright, I'm getting out of here so I don't see anything else. Alright, I think you're good. I don't know how far from. Oh! You're on a strap. You might want to just get off the strap. Oh, stop. Yep, there you go. So inches I have in front of the road? Inches? You want inches? You got to fit another car? Uh, I think so, but it's going to be the small car. Like a Fiat? Yeah. Small car? Yeah. Like how big? Toyota Yaris. Yaris? Yaris yeah. Oh, jeez. Oh, they, it's gonna uh, launch it into the fucking back of the. No, I know. No, the year. You have like a. A Yaris and a Yaris. A Yaris and a and a Yaris and a Yaris. Uh, He's gonna launch. Stop! 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 stop. Yeah, you're <laughs> oh my god, I'm done. I'm leaving. <laughs> That's it. I'm not seeing anything. I saw enough with this car. Jesus Christ! That was crazy, huh? <laughs> Dude, he almost <laughs> did three four drive launches. That was the park. <laughs> Boom. That was crazy. Caught on cam. I can't believe I did not book this. <laughs> FYI. <laughs> Alright, so you all set? Yeah, so you're that's good? The, that's the mirror is gonna the fold, fold in? Out. Um there's a button here. Alright, good? Yeah. Thank you. Perfect. Drive safe. Yeah, try. Uh, try. <laughs> she goes. You're my shot. Peace. Yours. I'll see you later. On to the next. On to the next. That was crazy. That was crazy. That was absolutely. <laughs> he launched it like eight times. Um, I gotta call the uh, the new owner and just inform him of who's in who's, who's in charge. Getting it off this and onto the enclosed. Uh, he's one. loading up a Yaris in back of it, and he's gonna do the same exact thing. The launch man. Hello. Hey, the car's on the trailer. It's all good. Okay, great. Oh my god, dude, this guy that's <laughs> he four wheel drive launched it about three times getting on the trailer. What do you mean by that? <laughs> like <laughs> going up the ramps. Like you're supposed oh to just god. lightly touch the throttle. He oh literally like god. launched it. All gas, all brake. All all gas, almost no brake into the back car. Um I got it all on film, so it's pretty funny. But regardless, car car's on the trailer. He has to load up one more behind it. Um Perfect. so I hope he is a rocket ship into it. Yeah, I, I hope so. I hope he's good. Okay, thank All you. Right. I'll do that. All right, man. Let me know when you get it. You got it. Bye-bye. I knew he was going to be a menace. I...
didn't this, expect the, talking to him on the phone. I didn't expect him to look like the that. The second I saw the matching maroon guest jumpsuit, go. Let's get out of here before he asks us for this help or something. An animal. So yeah, that was crazy. Um, Yuris is gone. We got a Porsche coming, so that's pretty cool. Uh, we got the blue truck getting some work done, and that's gonna be pretty cool. It's already cool, it's just gonna be a little bit quicker. So, if you know what that means. I haven't had a truck, and that's my personal truck right now, so as soon as I get it back, we're gonna do some burnouts and that thing. I am getting my driveway done at the house as well, and we're gonna do a burnout party in the driveway right before it gets done and film the whole construction process because American Contract Paving is doing it. That's going to be cool. That's coming up. Blue Truck's going to be doing some burnouts on my driveway. Neighbors will be pissed. Hopefully they don't see this video. Um, I don't really see a reason as to why my neighbors would watch this video. Oh, it's so bad. But yeah. Either way, yours is gone. Thank you for watching the video, guys. I will see you next vlog. Peace out.